where uh, I made my first uh, introduction with prairie dogs and I just have been crazy ever since. Billy's just a, you know, Billy's a vet and he's just a hell of a nice guy. They own a bunch of property. It's hard to, for me to convey to you guys how many great people that I meet doing what I do. Time for us to head out of Eastern Colorado and head on. Hi, are y'all crazy, man? Y'all honestly did not think that I'm about to leave Eastern Colorado and not shoot the hell out of some prairie dogs. We're gonna try to bring you some prairie dog explosion right into your living room. These things could possibly be worse than hogs, and this is definitely a problem. You can just see the holes all over the place out here. First dog that comes up is going down. There he is on top of the mound. See him? Shit. Who you think, right on? Oh! That was an aerial. That was aerial. You got him? Oh my God. Hi. He's yeah. down, Jimmy. There's a head sticking up on the mound just to the right of the camera. Go ahead, Marty. That was bad. That was bad. That's the uh, Silver Sportsman Award for most uh, high velocity spatter. Oh! You ready? Hornady, accurate, deadly, trade dog, defendable. Damn, Neil, I need some more ammo. Oh, look at this one. I tell you, it's not good. You shoot him in the head, Marty. What was that? <laughs> drive up there and you look and you don't think you're gonna have that much fun. But the minute you pull the trigger and then boom over here, boom, boom. Oh, there's two, boom, boom. You just, you get into it, man, and you can't stop, let me tell you. Besides hunting dangerous game, I don't know that there's anything I like any better than shooting prairie dogs.